today he'll show you the breakdown of one manipulation. This is the squince layer of my work. First started with the blank canvas. Then drop this sky image in the canvas. Then used exposure layer. Then I used level adjustment layer. Then I used this mountain image used camera raw filter while importing. Then used hue and saturation layer to desaturate and then used exposure layer also. Then I used tilt blur to give blur to mountain. Then I used this image as my foreground, and resized it. Then I used exposure layer to make it dark. Then made a new layer painted with grey color. Then I played with layer to make it natural. Then I took this image from Google and mask out with pen tool. Then I used filter gallery and hue and saturation layer to make it oldish color. Then I mask out center R of the book. Then I duplicated the layer as I hate to blend next image into it. Then I chose this image to blend it into the book. I placed it in the canvas. Then I clipped it with the mask created in the book. Then I selected the mask of the book and painted with black on it where I wanted to show the blended image. I used hue and saturation adjustment layer and their mask to match the color of tracks with the foreground. The in used a exposure layer clipped it the foreground and dropped the shadow of the book on the ground using dog bee and burn. Then I used this image and dropped into the canvas and masked out the model of this old man. I used exposure layer to match lighting of the model with other image. The again I used level adjustment layer. Then to create shadows of model I duplicated the model flipped it vertical and by exposure layer made it a lot darker and used was Xi'an blur to make it natural. Then I used Parmira raw filter and give it color grading like a vintage photo and that's all. If you want detail step by step explanation of techniques and tutorial leave like and comment. Please subscribe and share as we have just started this channel that will be a huge support. I hope you learned something from this video.